Hiya, so a common thing that people want to do on their WordPress sites is have down in the footer of their site uh, a copyright notice. Now, legally, I'm not a lawyer. I don't think you actually need a copyright notice, but obviously your country, your mileage may vary. Um, definitely, if you want it, you can have it. And we're gonna talk about how to make that copyright date automatically update so that you don't have to go into your footer file every year and change the 2017 to 2018 to 2019 to 2020 to 21 2021 so i'm running a child theme of 2017 already if you've not made a child theme already uh, you will need to do that we've got a quick guide for you we will link that um, what you're going to do is you're going to go into your file system i've got my 2017 theme child showing right here in my 20 uh, 17 parent theme showing and what I'm gonna do is open up this footer.php file and I'm gonna duplicate it duplicate that file over to my child theme so I'm gonna move it from the 2017 folder to the 17 child folder and what this will do is let me edit the contents of this footer file so to do a basic um, footer uh, copyright notice. So I just put say p tags and say copyright 2018 because that's my current year all rights reserved which is a common set of language again I'm not a lawyer this is not this does not constitute legal advice don't sue me whatever um, so if I do that and I refresh I can see my copyright notice there so the way we're going to make this year be dynamic is using PHP, which is the, the language that underlies all of WordPress. So PHP tags look like this, where I've got uh, what we might call an opening sigil, which is a less than signed a question mark and then the word PHP and then a closing one. And what we're going to do is use the PHP built-in function called date. Date is a function that, as you might expect, gets the date. By default, it will uh, use the current time as a source of that, and if I do a capital Y, I will get a year formatted in the same way, I believe, let me double check, as uh, I was previously getting it, but now it's going to be up to date. So if my computer time, I'm not gonna do this for you, changed drastically so that it was 2019 or 2017, you would see that year there rather than the current one. So this will always show the current year on your server um, to do that. So the code is pretty simple, just echo date, and you're basically all set. Thanks for watching. Uh, like and subscribe. All of those common YouTube uh, sensations. Uh, we appreciate them very much. And cheers. Have a good one.